Latvian President Edgar Rinkiewicz visited the border with Belarus and Russia on August 8, where he spoke with guards stationed along the fence separating the Baltic country from its eastern neighbors. Rinkiewicz stated that the significant amount of provocations from Russia and Belarus has led his country to enhance its border surveillance, especially in the context of Wagner troops being relocated to Belarus. In 2021 and 2022, NATO and EU countries neighboring Belarus, Poland, Latvia, and Lithuania faced a surge of border incursions from migrants. This compelled them to intensify their border protection and patrolling efforts. Although EU countries accused Minsk of exacerbating the migrant crisis, these allegations were denied. Currently, a period of increasing instability is unfolding in NATO countries bordering Belarus, fueled by concerns about the presence of Wagner Group mercenaries in Belarus and a surge in attempts by migrants to cross the frontier illegally. News about the Wagner mercenaries being stationed in, in Belarus. So, the overall conclusion is well, there is a lot of uh, work ahead of us uh, to improve and to invest in the border, but also there have been quite significant progress so far and also uh, we need to be prepared for all kinds of possible provocations also in the future. Our uh, friends and allies in NATO and the European Union need to understand that uh, the hybrid warfare, the least possible scenario could be uh, the kind of classic military operations. I think hybrid operations are the most uh, likely scenarios that we have to count on. If we talk about uh, military forces like Wagner, if they will try to enter to Latvia, it could be responsibility of our army or for our defense forces. And so uh, bodyguards uh, did quite many steps and so we introduced uh, additional uh, unit and so we train additional officers, train to use uh, weapons, uh, special tactic and etc. And so we improve our capacities to deal with uh, dangerous uh, border crossers. I have to say that the situation is quite challenging and uh, numbers and attempts of illegal border crossings uh, at this year is more than all um, last year 2022 commonly and we also see some and unfortunately quite many activities when Belarusian, Belarusian officials try to damage our fence or infrastructure and put illegal immigrants into Latvia.